to the Freak Show. Bumpy McSquiggums, Falk, and Jax here, and we are leaving to go back to the city of the Domeditude. Probably, maybe. That's a thing that we're probably going to manage to do. There's no guarantee of it. Except there is. Yes, there is. All right, I have no idea what I'm doing. We'll figure it out as we go, I suppose. And yeah, well, I think we're either done or mostly done with the Big Bang thing. So we can do that. I mean, there's a lot of stuff that we have done, a lot of stuff that we can still do. Still a lot of stuff in general, really. The game has so very much for us to accomplish. I don't know what would happen if we just, like, murdered our way through this. I think it'd be kind of fun. What's up, Gregor Uvenstieve? Uvenstieve? I got nothing. Hey, have you got a few shards for a veteran? Data is always useful. But I'm uncertain what this individual can offer us. Uh. And unless you show me the shards, you won't find out. Come on, do us both a favor. Come on, have a little heart. Just a few shards, okay? Uh-huh. Well, fine. There you go. There, take this. Thanks. Thank you. Oh, I won't forget this. Uh -huh. And since you have helped me, I'll make sure my contacts hear about it. You help me, I'll help you. Sweet. Come back in a few days, yeah? I'll have something that might interest you. Cool. Like Excellent. a giant pumpkin? Thank you, sir. Alright, who are you? You are Paige. Huh. What do we have here? Fresh meat? Well, it's pleasant to meet you as well. Pleasant to... Are you mentally stable? How did you get the guard to let you into the dome? The cleric? Preferential treatment, I bet. Seeing as you're a cleric. Yeah. However you got in, you're going to find it even harder to get out. Not really, I can tell the clerics are a little jumpy at the moment. You might say paranoid. So, when they do let someone in, it does make me wonder who they are and why the clerics thought letting them in was a good idea. If it's so hard to get in, what are you doing here? If it's so hard to get in, what are you doing here? I got in before things got so paranoid. And I came here for profit, of course. Lots of nervous people close to the Alps tend to be willing to invest shards in their safety, you see. And getting hold of supplies is hard out here. So, if you can get them, you can sell them for a high price. Well, that was the plan. Now, the clerics have stopped me trading and cut off all the supplies. Well, that's just not fortunate for you, is it, Paige? And you just let them do that? And you just let them do that? Of course I didn't let them. But getting around She's their ban isn't simple. It's impossible to get by the guards without an ID card. I don't have an and ID they card. they took mine from me as part of their crackdown. I probably do. Now they say I'm causing trouble. But what else is a businesswoman supposed to do when she has her business taken from her? Kill people? About your trade ban. About your trade ban. Yeah, yeah, don't tell me. Trading weapons can pose a danger to the community. But this is about self-defense. The only person who can stop a person with a gun is a person with an even bigger gun. No. Am I right? Smaller I mean, gun. What? Faster Are gun. Are we supposed to throw gun? rocks at the Albs when they attack? Yes. But the clerics want to keep all the guns for themselves and screw the rest of us. They call it neutrality, but I say it's oppression. I've heard it both ways. Eh, yeah. Alois knows that you are expecting a new delivery. Alois knows you are expecting a new delivery. Does he now? Well, he always was the most paranoid of them all. Still, let's say he's right. And that I could get a hold of supplies. Not from Tavar, obviously. They've blocked that route. Let's say I could get some weapons from the Separatists, for example. Let's say they have weapons and need shards. And that they also have the business acumen of a stunned troll. So they need a salesperson. <laughs> Me, for example. Uh huh. What if I was to say that? And what if I was to say that I have to find someone who could enter and leave the city freely? If I was to say that, then what would you say? 
I'd say you're walking a dangerous line. Do you really think you can trust the Separatist? Dangerous line. I'd say you're walking a dangerous line. Spoken like a true cleric. Can't you see I'm a victim here? This city is supposed to be neutral, not an enclave of the Horde. It's fair. So, where's the neutrality if only one side has guns? So if you blab, what have I lost? Nothing. That's fair, You've too. You've any guns to show. It's just your word against mine. And even Alois isn't going to see that as justice. I could help you get your weapons. I could help you get your weapons. You? A cleric? Well, need makes strange bedfellows, but yeah. you'll have to show me that I can trust you. How about... How about you give me a down payment? A sort of security deposit? And I'll go with that. Don't worry. You'll get enough back as payment if you complete the deal to offset your deposit. How does that sound? Well, it sounds... Risky for me, but okay. You can trust me. Pay me, and I will. You don't need payment. You will just trust me. Yes! You don't need a payment. You will just trust me. Right. Trust you. Sure. Sure. Now that I think about it, you do look trustworthy. Yes! So, this is what you need to do. Jedi Leave mind tricks, go! a separatist called Radok. I think he's a separatist, but whatever he is, he's a mad fucker. I can't make sense of most of what he says. Okay. But he has the weapons, and he likes trade. I think he likes trade. It's hard to tell. He wants to sell the weapons, but you'll have to work on him, okay? He won't just hand them over. Kill him. Got it. Where can I find Radok? Up in the Highlands. When we last spoke, he told me he was going to head over to the Northeast. He mentioned an abandoned wind turbine. Oh, goody. With luck, he'll still be out there. Heh, <laughs> you think he will. He's not gonna be any- I need to select that as a thing, don't I? Alright. The thing with the map and- Oh, yeah? Oh, he's right there. Alright, well, I'm gonna leave the domed city. And I'm gonna go find Captain Turbine. He's our hero. He's got the cool glasses and stuff. Well, if there's anything else to kill along the way, I will be more than happy to murder it. It is sort of what I do. Hey, guy. You did. Really glad that you jumped at uh, Falk because I was not prepared to do battle with you. Eh, eh. What's going on, man? I know where Ray is. So, you've got one of these contracts. So, you've got one of these contracts. You know about them, do you? Well, yes, I've got one. And I'm going to claim the reward for it. No, you're not. Uh, give me the contract or I'll kill you. Give me the contract or I'll kill you. Now you want to get killed for that, idiot? Do, 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 do you realize how... You'll regret that. Uh oh, that's how dumb you are. I'm attacking. Sorry, buddy. Bomby the Defiant. Well, we gotta kill six more people. We're at the point now where eh, just don't don't upset us and you might live, but you know, I'm done with the nonsense. I'm clearly the biggest threat out here right now. And if you're gonna, you know, oh, hello. If you're gonna be annoying and, and stupid, then I'm gonna make you pay for it. Oh, hello. Would you like to be my friend? You would. Oh, it's adorable. Well, too bad. Friends list is full. Sorry. Anyway, so if you're going to be annoying and stupid, then you're just not going to be alive anymore. That's pretty much that simple. Oh, no, I got waist deep in water. Ah, oh, these aren't waterproof pants. Ah, oh, I'm going to be squishing everywhere. Why are there dead clerics here? I'm going to take their stuff. Just kind of letting you know that. 
I'm gonna open your chest too and take whatever's in there. Oh, I got a report and a ring of hardiness. Hey, dude. You once possessed great Elix abilities, didn't you? Yeah, I did. You're probably a soldier from Zaycor, possibly even a commander. Yep. But you are now free from Elix and from the orders that come from the heart of Zaycor. Have you come here to die like the clerics that I just killed? Or are you here to trade? Well, you know, your threats don't scare me, buddy. Your threats don't scare me. Scare? That's an emotional response. You should remember where you come from. If you are seeking protection among the free people, your past will have made you a marked man to both sides. Mm -hmm. It only takes one wrong person to recognize you. And you'll be dead. See that sword I have on my hip? That alone is more than enough to deal with you, buddy. Paige sent me. Paige? Do I know Paige? Faces and names of the free people? Mm. They merge into one. But you must mean the woman from the domed city. But I have business to conclude before we speak. Uh -huh. It seems there are two followers of Kalan nearby of course there are. who are anxious to see their god in person. And I must send them on their way. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. Quickly, decide. Will you stand with me in battle? Uh, nope. This is none of my business. You disappoint me. For if you don't stand with me, that must mean you are my enemy. Whatever, man. I am gonna dodge that nonsense. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh god. Sorry about your everything. Woo! Well, that was easy. What? 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 What are you? What are you doing? What are you doing? Huh? Just getting jiggy with it? Huh? I can't do that, but if I could, I would. This is the best I can do. Uh... Okay, it's no. It's not fun. What you doing? That dog really believed he could get away from us. Why do you have a or alb, they're all impure. Thing. And he paid the price with blood. We're leaving this position as soon as the troop commander gives the signal. If you need something from him, you should speak to him now. Uh-huh. Where where is he? Now the alb is dead. Kalan's will has been carried out. Here, a symbol of his mercy. Now it is cool. time to take the fight to Zekor. May Kalan guide your path in safety until the Alps are defeated. Yeah, sure. Okay, well, I, I mean, I kind of completed the mission. I mean, not exactly the way they intended, mind you, but, you know, I, I completed the mission. I'm fine with that. I'm totally, completely happy with how things went. Not a problem whatsoever. Kalan uses all... All right, so here we are. Don't talk to me. I don't want to talk to you now. Hey, Separatist dude. Wait, what? What are you doing? Why are you out here now? Ah, you're back. Hand over the weapons delivery. You're back in business. Good. I was hoping for some higher caliber stuff, but this will do. If you'd brought spitballs and blowpipes, I'd find someone to buy them. People Man. just aren't feeling safe right now. Here, this is for getting your feet sore and arranging the deal. I'll want to speak to you to arrange another delivery. There won't be any more. Your contact, Radok, is dead. That is a setback. Still, one less mad fucker yeah, to deal know, with. I, I suppose I'll have to try and find an alternative contact. Mm -hmm. But I'll have to sell this stock first, eh? Yep. Uh... I'm just gonna sit in your chair. Ah, it's nice and warm. Okay. They no. say the raptors are pretty fierce. Yeah, no, raptors are not fierce. Better armed is better prepared. Better armed is better prepared. Maybe is later. Bad. You definitely got the wrong end of the stick. Uh, excuse you? You need a break every once in a while if you're going to stay sane. Do you get one? Okay, well you guys can keep talking. I don't know what I'm supposed to do in here. There's a lot of just random nasty in this place. And I don't mean, like, the gal nasty. What's up, Riley? Did you flee here from the desert? Did you flee here from the desert? Flee? 
No. But to live in Tavar, you need shards. And despite my talents, I wasn't one of the Duke's favorites, and that made making a profit hard. Fair enough. You think it's better here? Yes, for sure. For me, at least. And those berserkers are the worst for it. One of those assholes killed my friend for fun. That's not nice. Now that bastard is focused on me and nobody's helping me. Even though they know it'll be their turn next and keeping their head down won't save them. Who's this berserker? Who is this berserker that's giving you trouble? Braback. <clears throat> a bull of a man and twice as ugly. Bone breaking bastard. Uh huh. Yeah, about the Braback. About Braback. Where can I find him? Where can I find Braback? He's usually near the inn. Just follow your nose. If it smells like piss, you found him. Probably. Leave Braback to me. No, I don't think that's a good idea. N no, no, I actually, I don't want a cleric going anywhere near him. I'll end up in trouble with Alois, and that'll be almost as bad. I'm screwed either way. Let's trade. Okay. All right. Um, do you have any guns? New. No. I mean, guns. I mean, uh, ammo. I don't have much of Lexit. Kind of struck rock bottom, didn't I? All right. Did we actually get a quest, or is he just like, please don't hit me? I don't want to die. All right. Well, I am gonna go over here then, I guess. Because, you know, reasons. And we'll figure out what's next. There's a bunch of places to go and to see. I saw you. You Excuse saw me? me what? I saw how you came through into the dome. Who are you? Why were you allowed I, in? I walked in? I'm a cleric. I'm a cleric. I should have known clerics wouldn't follow their own rules. This city is supposed to be sealed. No one is supposed to be allowed in. But I suppose you clerics should be allowed some privileges as thanks for offering us all protection. I wouldn't want to have to deal with the outlaws. There you go, say End look. up with the city here like the Fort and Tavar? No thanks. Not to mention the damn separatists here. They may say they're not Albs anymore, but you can't trust them, whatever they are. Uh-huh. And what do you have against them? What do you have against the separatists? They are coming here, to our city. The only city with a real chance of peace among the factions. Mm. If it was up to me, then we would make sure these Albs went somewhere else. They might say we have the same goal, the same enemy. But I don't believe a word of what they say. Who says they aren't spies sent here to deactivate the dome? They can't be trusted. Well, if you say so. So you want to have all the Separatists thrown out of the city? You want to have all the Separatists thrown out of the city? Yeah. And you know what? I have already started to make it happen. Oh? I'll recruit anyone who'll help get this done. We have an eyewitness who claims to have seen the Separatists exchanging information with the Alps. Really? Traitorous bastards. Who is this witness? Who is this eyewitness? The Berserker Yorg saw Fenk meet with an Alb in front of the city. Really? Why would they meet if it wasn't to exchange information about the dome? Sadly, Yorg is the only one who's seen Fenk. And now he started saying he isn't sure he really saw Fenk meet an Alb from Zaycor. So I have to jog Yorg's memory. Or make sure he stops denying what he said. There has to be a way to do that. I can make sure Yorg stops denying his story. You don't think that Yorg could have been wrong in the first place? You don't think that Yorg could have been wrong in the first place? No, never. You can't trust these separatists. They'll betray us sooner or later for sure. Seems like I'm you're the one that you, wants to do the... This is just the beginning. Betraying. Who exactly are you? Who are you? Caleb. I lead the berserkers who've chosen to settle here in Abessa. Uh-huh. You are separate from the berserkers in Udan? We have kept our beliefs, but left behind the laws. We have set our own rules here. Well, none of us are allowed to return to Udan now. Or we just end up being sent to the valley. As to why they came here, while well, the first settlers were sent to Abessa to plant a world heart to expand the forest of Udan out here. But they were cut off from Udan by the Alps, left on their own to survive. And after a while, they decided to keep it that way. Fair the enough. The warlords in Goliath weren't happy. But they're stretched too thin for another conflict, so here we are. And since they settled here, 
Others have joined us. Some are escaped exiles. Others just chose to leave Idan. Well, I can make sure York stops denying his story. You can? Do you think you can make York stick to his original story? It's for the good of the city. So go to York and make sure he doesn't talk. Either help jog his memory a bit, or make sure he stays quiet. I don't care which. It can never be said again that the Albs might be innocent. I told him he can forget about that. They're only saying that to keep control of you. Uh-huh. Who knows what they're going to find in those ruins next? Yeah, well that all sounds awful. Nothing to see here. Gonna casually sit down. Okay, I feel better now. Ah, it's just I'm um, all well rested and it's great. Nobody saw anything. It's a locked chest that I'm gonna open because I'm amazing. That too was easy. too easy. Yeah. Clearly, no one will ever find out that I was here doing these things that I'm clearly not here doing. And just casually walk over here. Okay. Energy reserve drink. Well, not exactly the most useful of things, but I'll take it. Well, so far I do not like this place. This place is meh. This place is very meh. I will take some fragmentation rockets, though. How do I get into this place? A front, side, back, door, something, any path that leads inside, I'll take at this point. It's gonna be like this again, is it? Did I get in trouble the last time I was here stealing ammunition? I feel like I did. Alright. Ta-da! better go. It's about time. I went. Hey, what are you doing? I'm trying to figure out where I'm supposed to be going. I need to talk to somebody. Is it you? It's you. He's not going to be happy with me. Yeah, about the delivery. About the outlaw's weapons delivery. Someone else took the delivery of the weapons. Someone else took delivery of the weapon shipment. What? Who? I needed to stop those weapons getting out into the city. Didn't you promise to help me? I gave you the shards you needed to do the job. And this is how you repay my trust? Newcomers, why do you cause so much trouble? Show me your ID. Uh-huh. Here it is. Well, it looks all right. Seeing as that's valid, I will have to let you go. Uh -huh. If you aren't willing or able to help me, then you should go and lead me to get on with my work. That was amateurish. Just eh. one more term. Then I can retire. Okay. Well, that was super fun times, I guess. I don't know. Don't really care for the Dome City. find it to be kind of underwhelming. The political tension and the, the, just the hatred of everybody hating everybody. Eh. Welcome. Hey, how come I haven't seen you here before? I am really I good at knew hiding. All of the clerics in Abessa. I haven't been here long. The same with me. I haven't been with the clerics for long. I have been a member of almost all of the factions, except the Albs. And I hope I don't get captured and turned into one of those emotionless husks. Yep, me too. So, what do you mean you've tried them all? What do you mean you've tried all of the factions? That's a long story. If you're really interested in my tale, then I will tell you, of course. My personal quest is to discover more about Magellan and the people who live here. I would like to know more. There. Shall I tell you then? Let me think about Creepy. it. Creepy! What are you doing here in Abessa? Well, you know, I was just chilling. What are you doing here in Abessa? I take care of the mechs and drones here in the city. Which means I coordinate and plan their maintenance and upgrades. Cool. When I'm lucky, I get to roll up my sleeves and do some of the actual maintenance. 
which I'm having to do quite a lot with all the technicians we're missing. Say, are you good with technology? Nah. I know enough to work on Max. I know enough to work on Max. You do? Apparently. Maybe we could take you on in a permanent position here in the city. Do you think they would employ me? That's true. Alois has security concerns about taking anyone who's not been in the city long enough. So, yeah, maybe I should look for someone else. On the other hand, if you're looking for Sweet. some part-time work, I could still use your help. I have four people I've been told I should look at for taking the technician's job, but I don't have time to gauge their abilities. Would that be something you could do for me? I'd pay you. Yeah, I'll talk to your candidates. Yeah, I'll talk to your candidates. Great. The four names I have are Daryl, Naira, Rorick, and Riley. Though I'm really not sure about Riley. There's something about him I don't trust. But speak to each of them and let me know whether you think they might have the right skills and abilities for the job. Oh, and I'll need you to let me know about their loyalties. You know, can they work with clerics? Do they hate us? We'd be trusting them with the mechs and AI that defend the Dome City. So I don't want to employ anyone who might still be thinking about their faction, not our security. Oh boy. Okay. About the candidates for technician. Yes? Um, I'll get back to you on that one. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I think you I'm going to... definitely got the wrong end of the stick. Okay, I think I'm going to break off the episode right here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Uh, again, I'm, I'm a little underwhelmed with the whole... Are you thinking of stealing something? Yes. Yes, I am. Anyhow, I'm a little underwhelmed overall with the, the City of the Doomed. It's kind of meh, in my opinion, but... Well, apparently a lot of people like this place. I think it's one of the more interesting things, me personally. Never been big on the whole political intrigue. Oh, the tensions are high. Uh, you know, eh. Meh. Meh. But that's neither here nor there. What is here, and or maybe there, is there's a weapon that I would like to get my little grubby hands on. Probably don't need it, but I'm going to take it anyway. Anyway, I'm done alluding and polluting for right now. In the next episode, I guess I'll continue to linger around and see if I can't do a few more quests. But then I'm going to go turn in the Big Bang and continue with that. Like I said, this place doesn't interest me that much. It's not as... I mean, I'm not... There's nothing for you here. Oh, okay. Sorry, apparently you just saw me up here and all like... Yeah, there's not a lot of quests. I mean, it's pretty spaced out. I don't know. I just... I don't like it as much as all the other ones that we've done so far. It's like I wasn't a super big fan of Tavar, though that one got a bit more interesting as time went on. What with the inclusion of nasty and all that, so... Yeah, we'll see. Either way, I'll probably still run through it and get some of the things done at least, if nothing else. Get a few more quests completed and maybe another level or two, and then we will, well, head on and continue doing other stuff. I'm not sure how close we are to the end of the game, but it feels like we're well, over halfway at this point for sure. Anyway, folks, until the very next episode, my name is Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by The Freak Show, and I will see you later. <laughs>